So my name is Marco Tempest. I'm a cyber illusionist, which means I combine magic and science to create illusions. Today I'm here at ISC and I'm uh, giving a keynote address to all these uh, technologists and vendors, which is very exciting because it's like a, a toy store for me here. I'm going to go to the show floor in just a minute and, uh, and see if there's some new inspirations around. I saw there are like LED globes and uh, new type of display technologies. Very, very exciting. You know, when, if I say I'm, I'm a magician, then the story is over. It's much more interesting to say, well, I don't know, because then we have something to talk about. I think magicians are historically scientists. They're always looking for the newest things, the newest trends, and they, they adapt new technologies early and incorporate them into their work. So, um, so in a way, what I'm doing is very traditional. And, uh, and, and very exciting at the same time because there's this kind of interplay between what is possible and what will be possible soon and how can I use magic to make what will be possible soon ready now. So I started magic when I was really young and, uh, um, and I have a passion for learning new things and solving problems so if I'm inspired to create something new in my work I always try to um, to acquire that skill, so which could be programming or fabrication or video editing or whatever it is. So uh, uh, we live in a world right now where it's very easy to have access to, to information and where education no longer has to be just in the classroom. I think you can, you can teach yourself pretty much anything on the internet. So uh, I'm a great beneficiary of that. The process of creating what I do is very collaborative. So it's like camaraderie, it's like a family of people who work together to create things. So I, while I try to kind of be the, the chief architect of what's happening, there, is, there are many opinions and many talents which, uh, which flow into what I do. So there are software engineers, technologists, uh, composers, designers, writers. So there's a, it's a very diverse, broad group of people which I like to work with. And I think um, um, the result is always more interesting if you, if you work in a kind of interdisciplinary group and especially if you don't compartmentalize things too much. So it's really great to, instead of saying, you're in charge of the music and you're in charge of, of this to uh, actually keep it very open and, uh, and have everybody kind of uh, play along and make it, and make it happen.